We're in Sebastian now. We left Vero, Vero Beach at like 7.15 a.m. Doing a steady five and a half knots. That's about 6.3 miles per hour. Still got some squalls, some little storms in the area. Just, just a little bit of rain. We haven't really looked at the chart to see how far we're gonna go today. Maybe New Smyrna or Daytona. Slow and steady. What the? That's a bad day. Anytime there's a big boat that comes by in the interval, so we just turn directly into the wake so that we don't get it on our side and roll sideways. We just kind of go into it, go up and down gently. Because when we're on the intercoal, so we kind of have a lot of stuff out that, there's my computer. We don't have everything locked, locked and secured like we do when we're gonna go out in the ocean. So try and keep it comfortable and not let anything fall. gonna go check out a little island over here take jetty for a walk get a little workout in so this is the same exact so when I came down here on Tula I anchored like right here Sierra like five four or five years ago I came down from Long Island on my sailboat and I anchored right here so we have Cape Canaveral's like down there we came up the Indian River on the other side of Cape Canaveral's the Banana River and then where we're going tomorrow up and across this piece of land it's called the mosquito lagoon mosquito lagoon so we have a few kind of points of interest along our trip going up to long island next to saint augustine saint augustine is supposed to be a pretty cool place and both of us have never really explored it at all fountain of youth a bunch of state parks alligator preserve so we're gonna make it to St. Augustine tomorrow and hopefully we'll have some time in the afternoon to explore the area a little bit. And after that, our next point of interest is gonna be Amelia Island, the Fernandana Beach area. Go ahead. Hi. They're mating too, everyone's mating. What else did you see mating today? Turtles and dolphins. Why are there cactus everywhere? Oh, wow. Oh yeah, there's cactus everywhere. Cacti. We're out on this deserted little island, just trying to get a little workout in, because we were stuck on the boat all day. So we're just doing some running and some exercising. Beautiful. We got like ospreys flying around. Manatee out right in front of us. It's amazing out here. I'm done.
our boat for dinner, but you gotta see this big boat that's anchored next to us. Really cool. That thing is sweet. Home sweet home. Sunset aboard Neverland. We're just making some dinner here. We just want to thank you guys for hanging out with us today, coming along with us on this trip up the East Coast, and if you guys want to support our vlogs, there's a few ways you can do that. First off, we have a Patreon account. <laughs> another way you can support is if you guys shop on, <laughs> Sierra threw his cauliflower scrap and hit the ceiling. If you guys shop on Amazon, everyone shops at Amazon, if you guys shop at Amazon, you can just click one of our Amazon links in the description just to any product and do your normal Amazon shopping through that link. And there's no extra cost to you, but we'll get a little tiny percentage as a commission for referring you to shop on Amazon. Sierra's been working really hard on making videos for no. Jetty. Jetty's been working really hard on making videos and Jetty started a channel and it's called Jetty the Gypsy. That's in the description as well. So you guys can click that and check it out. Follow Jetty along on her boat adventures. Well, we just want to thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you guys later.